Well, I do have the misfortune of being a lawyer and there is this bias that you have as a lawyer that every time you see a problem, you assume that law is the solution. And I think it's part of the solution, but I was an activist long before I was a lawyer. As a 12 year old, I was in the streets protesting against police violence. As a teenager, I was helping form interfaith uh, coalitions. And that community centered work, I think is indispensable to any effective reform movement, to any effective effort to abolish mass surveillance as we seek at STOP. Because there's so many interdependent uh, uh, power structures that help enable or block surveillance. So by working to pass new laws that we can then enable additional legislation, but none of that's possible without public education campaigns to democratize this debate. Because right now it's oftentimes so technical, both in terms of the technology and in terms of the legal structures when we're having these conversations, but this is something that affects all of us. And in at this moment in history, we need this to be a debate that engages everyone who is affected because that uh, otherwise we are undermining the democratic process itself.